Alongside head Havilland men's basketball coach Johnny Estelle, I'm Mark and Sarah for Havilland Athletics after a 77-75 overtime win. And coach, what could be described, I think, as, as a wild, frenetic basketball game. But you guys found a way in overtime to get the win. What did you think? You, what was the key today? Just a lot of guts, a lot of heart, and a lot of mental toughness. Um, man, me and Coach Boone go way back, and he's done a phenomenal job, even back to our JUCO days. And, you know, his staff, and, you know, they do a great job of recruiting high, highly uh, talented individuals, and they've got a really good team. Um, and, and to be able to uh, come back after Thursday, performance and uh, show up here today and uh, play I was I was just ecstatic it wasn't about the numbers you know the stats you know they're not pretty we're not really shooting the ball as well as we were before this game was all about guts and 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 just wanting the you know the will to win and and what a crowd man I mean I'm telling you man I mean we had community members the football team other athletes other you know members of uh you know the Havilene Nation that really helped us uh win tonight an atmosphere like that in the spec every game would make this a pretty fun place to be on every Thursday or Saturday night when you look at overtime the lead swung back and forth a few times they scored first you guys came back what, how did you keep your team kind of even keel or, or level-headed over that stretch well I, I you know I think that you know I just told them they, you know, they work hard. They deserve to win and and keep them calm. They made some mistakes, you know. There was some uncharacteristic turnovers there, uh, but you know, you're going to have some of those in a in a high, highly contested battle like this. So, you know, CJ did a good job. You know, he he didn't let that play phase him. He had a couple of turnovers where he bounced back. He, you know, he puts pressure on himself like any other good player, but he bounced back. You know, Jake Majors, he took, uh, you know, took a quick three, I thought, but but he came back and hit that big three. You know, he just. Just, just has that, you know, that heart, that, you know, the heart of a lion, so to speak. So we have a lot of guys like that. You know, you watch us and you've covered us and guys that just, you know, they just high character individuals that pull together and, and they play hard for the Heavenly Nation. And just, we're very fortunate to, to win tonight. You had five. What was the message to your team tonight at, before overtime got started? Uh, we're good. We're at home. I mean, we, we you know, we've played well enough to win this ball game, you know, and uh, we got five more minutes to play and we're built for this, you know, and, uh, you know, we, we practice this way. We, you know, we play different lineups as you could probably have noticed, you know, I, I mean, Sammy Brooks, I thought came in and gave us a spark. And I mean, it just, everyone who contributes, uh, no matter what the lineup and the rotation is, they're playing for us. And, and that's a huge difference in today's game. Cause you know, that's very hard to get, you know, when you look at, you ask some coaches around there, they can have a bunch of talent or they can have a bunch of individuals, but they're not playing for the school. They're not playing for the staff, but these young men that we've put together, me and coach Gonzalez, um, I mean, they, they, they deserve to win because of who they are and where they come from. Their parents did a great job. Um, they, they come here and they love this place. And uh, it's just really good to see the fans come out and get rewarded with a great uh, effort. What's the tone of your message to your team after a game like tonight? Man, um, it's going to be excitement. You know, I mean, I'm happy. I'm, I'm very proud of them. Proud. Proud is the word, probably. Um, you know, I, I could be a little tough on them at times, not, you know, demeaning, but tough because I, I want them, because they work so hard and, and, and who they are as people, I want them to experience winning at a high level. You know, and that's my whole goal as a coach. I, you know, they're only going to play this game for so long. And I want them to, you know, have some of the memories together collectively. We always say they're writing their, you know, legacy. So this is a huge page in that book of it. But we got a lot more to write. So uh, we're going to enjoy this win. Uh, we're 6-2. and I uh, think, you know, we could easily be, uh, you know, 8-0. and zero, But you learn from our mistakes through those two losses to those two really good teams. And we're going to kind of de-escalate. We're in finals. You know, compete in the classroom, finish with A's and B's. And then we're going to get ready for uh, St. Edward's. Now, I know, Coach, you, you talked about how what the crowd, what the atmosphere is like, what the crowd was like in this game. I know sometimes you like to send a message to the Havilland Nation at the end of these interviews. Do you have a message for the fans tonight? Uh, you know, this win was all about you. You know, I mean, we represent you every day. And, I, and I've said that in every public um, atmosphere I have a chance to talk with. You know, I talk to alumni. I said, this is your school. And, you know, you see this sign say, make it yours. Well, this program is a part of this institution. And when you show up and you support us and we're out there – busting our tails to represent you this is the memories and the experience that we want for you as a student and we want for our kids as student athletes so we can't thank you enough and uh please come back uh, i know it'll be a few days before we have a game here uh but hey come in town early from uh, the christmas break and uh cheer on the javelinas december 31st is the next time the hogs will be at home coach congrats on the win thank you for your time go enjoy this win hey thank you guys